Hey, what's going on guys? It's Tommy353 here, and <clears throat> welcome to my new Let's Play on Super Metroid. One of my favorite games on the Super Nintendo. So, um, this is not one of Nintendo's uh, little less common uh, series, um, the Metroid series. So, what's that? what that is, a, I can't talk. Um... Oh, and this is a different emulator, as you can see, it's my Super Nintendo emulator, so that's what, um, uh, saving a state looks like. Um, so yeah, I actually have to, um, delete this file, because I actually already tried recording, and, um, uh, something actually, uh, happened. Um, what happened was, um, it was lagging a lot, and apparently the Super Nintendo has, a uh, higher, has to require a higher... Um, processing power so then the Game Boy Advance so I tried a couple things to fix it until I finally fixed it just now um, first I tried going into my emulator and setting like process priority or something from high to normal and that didn't help I tried doing a lot of other things so and then I tried changing stuff in my recording app and that seemed to help so what I did is I um, changed uh, the recording quality from 720 pixels to 540 pixels. So it's not going to be HD anymore, but I don't notice it any difference. And as I said, this is like a 16-bit game, and it's really hard to tell when 16-bit games are in HD and when they're not. So it's it's obviously going to be fine. So, um, so you shouldn't have to worry about the quality that much, and that stopped the lag, so, um, yeah, let's jump right in, I already had to read all this, uh, text, and now I have to do that all again, because I have to record it again, so, yeah. The last Metroid is in captivity. The galaxy is at peace. I first battled the Metroids on planet Zebes. It was there that I foiled the plans of the space pirate leader, Mother Brain, to use the creatures to attack galactic civilization. And that was from the last game, because this is Metroid 3, that was in Metroid 2. And oh god, do I remember fighting Metroid, um, or me, I mean, uh, Mother Brain with all the... Hi, Cheerios flying at ya. I next fought the Metroids on their homeworld, SR388. I completely eradicated them except for a larva, which, after hatching, followed me like a confused child. I personally delivered it to the Galactic Research Research Station at I don't know how to say that at Cirrus, so scientists could study its energy-producing qualities. The scientists' findings were astounding. They discovered that the powers of the Metroid might be harnessed for the good of civilization. Satisfied that was all well, oh, uh, satisfied that all was well, I left the station to seek a new bounty to hunt. But I uh, had hardly gone beyond the asteroid belt when I picked up a distress signal. Sirius Station was under attack. So here we are. This is the beginning. So, um, yeah, uh, the frame rate was super laggy right when I jumped off of this thing when I started recording. I was just like, oh shit, it's all laggy. Come on, damn it. Okay, so now that I figured out how to record this, so yeah, you can look up with the D-pad up and look down with the D-pad down. Uh, you can do something other, uh, also with the down button later. 
uh, actually not much later, probably in episode two, or maybe even, no, not this episode, but yeah, you can look up uh, diagonally with the right button and the R button, and L does that, yeah, it looks down, so, yeah, let's uh, move on, this area is pretty short, um, because we're not at Planet Zebes yet, so this is where the, uh, this place is where the Metroid larva was, uh, found, as you can see in the next room, probably, I believe it is. Oh shit, dead scientists. I don't know why this game is still rated E for everyone, but who gives a shit? So, yeah, the Metroid Lava obviously broke out of here and, uh, did some high stuff. He obviously, um, the scientists had been feeding him the wrong dose, so, yeah. <laughs> And something unexpected is, well, I'm pretty sure everybody sees it coming. Whatever, uh, oh, hey there, buddy. Uh, uh, I thought you killed the world. What the? I mean, like, come on, dude, that's evil. Just don't do it. What the? F Holy shit. Okay, yeah, this guy is Ridley. He is, um, one of the main antagonists in, uh, the Metroid series. He's a, like, dragon thing. So, yeah. Uh, this is where, um, okay, I'm not gonna keep on talking about this the whole video, but, yeah, it was super laggy right here when I was playing this part. I was just like, okay, nope, I have to fix this. Okay, like, right there, it's starting to lag, but it's fine, though. God damn, stop fucking hitting me. Oh, yeah, there's your energy meter on the top left. It's getting a little laggy, but who cares? It was way worse than this before. Now it's clean. Shiz. Uh, 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 just spam that X button, though. Oh, shit. Oh, damn. Oh, yeah, there's the end of this fight. Emergency, emergency! Lockdown, lockdown! Wee-oo, 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 wee-oo! Put your hands up and the da da da. I don't know the lyrics. Oh crap, I'm on low HP. Okay, so. Yeah, the place is all red. We gotta run. We gotta do this. Do 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 Those little puffs of smoke, like, hurt me a bit. Well, they don't hurt me, but they stun me. Oh, crud, it's tilting! Ah, uh, shit. Oh, lord, there we go. Boom. Called it. Kind of. I knew that was going to happen. I played this game before. Oh, what's that purple planet? Is that a star? I don't even know. I never noticed that. Okay. I never noticed the most obvious thing in six beat in a 16-bit cutscene. So yeah, here we are arriving on planet Zebes, which is literally the planet that we're going to be spending the entire rest of the game on. Okay, here we are. So, um... Yeah, this is Planet Zebes. Um, so, basically, this game is really fun. I really love this game. It's mainly because, um, well, if you press start, you can look at the map. And, basically, you just go and get power-ups to access areas you couldn't before. To access this, access that, yada, yada, yada. So, yeah. Um, I find that really fun. It's kind of like an open-world game. It's really unique, and uh, some people say this is the best um, Metroid game there was, and I 100% agree with that, and I think it is. So yeah, these doors, basically, you can just shoot them to go through them. Um, that we cannot do yet. Um, I think I'm going the right way. Down the hole. 
Am I going the right way? I don't know. Um. Oh, I, I, okay, I'm going the right way. Pretty sure. But, anyways, we'll figure out where we're supposed to go, because it's pretty, it's kind of, well, it's not obvious. I'm not going to, I don't want to say it's obvious where you, you're supposed to go. Oh, yeah, you're supposed to go through here, I remember. Okay. I know where I'm supposed to be going. Uh, uh, uh. Did I already make it to... Wait. What is down here? Uh, it won't tell me unless I... Am I seriously supposed to... Be going down here? Okay, if it's blue... If it's like a really dark blue color, then yeah, I'm supposed to be going down here. Okay, yes. It, this is where I'm supposed to go. Okay, good. Because I remember, this is where you're supposed to go at the very beginning of the game. So, yeah. Um. Oh, Lord. What am I doing? So over here, da 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 da, we have our first power up, the morph ball, morphing ball. I was close. Come on, give me some one hundred dollars in monopoly money here. Oh god, oh god, intruder alert, intruder alert. Don't worry, that doesn't do anything. So yeah, now if we press down twice, we can go into a ball. So, um, oh. I know we're. S Wait, where the hell are we supposed to go? Uh. Oh. Oh. I'm stupid. Okay, just shoot that little block there. Okay. Um. Believe there's something we can access over here now. Or just go in this door. Um. We don't have. Okay, we gotta go down here. Huh. Okay, yes, now we can go over here. Good. Good, good, good. It's all good. And here we have another power-up. Yes, this is a power-up. A room made specifically for power-ups. And so, yeah, just shoot the little ball in the, the guy's hand. And yes, we got missiles. Okay, good. This is our first, like, main power-up. And, um... Yeah, uh, you, you can only have a number of them. Each uh, missile container you get and contains five. So whenever we find, there are rooms um, like this um, that have uh, missile containers hidden all over this place. And um, yeah, if you find them, uh, they'll give you five missiles and upgrade. Just press select to use one. They're just like regular um, bullets, but they're uh, way more powerful. And now we can open those red doors by using five missiles on them. Yes, five. Uh, we have to use our whole load, but we can refill our load because there are um, rooms made specifically that will refill your uh, missiles or just get another missile tank or whatever. So, yeah. Uh, you can also get missiles from enemies, but that's uh, going to be way later in the game, I believe. Uh, and we got another missile tank. So, uh... Jeez, I want something. I want to. I want something funny to say. Um. So yeah, I just had a dentist appointment today, and um, I I have to get a tooth extracted on May fourteenth, I believe. And oh god, I'm nervous for that. But it's a month away. And then, like, it feels like tomorrow. It's a month away. And tomorrow, I'm gonna be at the dentist. No, I'm just kidding, but... It's gonna feel like tomorrow. And there's bitches in this room now. Oh, yeah, those uh, enemies will usually drop little uh, purple ball. Oh, okay, never mind. Um, okay, okay. Uh, two enemies right there we just got missiles from. Okay, maybe not way later in the game. Um, but, yeah, those little purple balls, some enemies drop them. Um, and they'll heal your energy. So, oh uh, god, there's some in here, aren't there? Oh my god. Ah. And yeah, we have like two t types of jumps. One is usually if you just jump straight up, that will happen. You'll just do that jump. Or if you jump 
Wow, okay, I'm falling down. I'm trying to go up. If you jump... Wow, that thing went away. That will heal my HP. Goddamn, I keep on distracting myself. That's gonna be an annoyance. Okay, whenever you jump, like, sideways, um, mostly sideways, you'll do, like, a barrel roll like that. Um... Oh, wow, I actually got back on the platform. Yay, hooray for me. Oh, shit. Oh, God. There we go. Up, 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 up the slope. I don't care about you. Oh, stupid green Shreks. Urgh. Dear God, dear God, just shoot him in the ass. Oh, God, oh, God, oh, God. Crud. These platforms are so narrow. Why do they have to be so narrow? Oh, God, it's kind of laggy, but I'll fix it in the next video. Somehow, I'll figure out something, guys. Oh, my God, everything's gonna be okay. Everything's not gonna be okay. Okay. Platforming. Damn it! Oh, please. Okay. Okay. Uh, low on energy. Yes, finally. Oh, God. I don't know why that was so difficult. Um, geez, this episode's like 20 minutes long already. Um, I'm actually gonna end it off here. Uh, we only got the morphing ball and the missiles, but hey, uh, that's probably as far as other people get on their first part in other Let's Plays, too. So, yeah, um, I'm just gonna get up here to the top, the surface. If these... Oh, God, enemies are appearing. Uh, they, they weren't here before. Uh, bitch. Mm. Okay, I'm gonna sweat, set the quality down to, like... You know what? Um, nah, I'm not gonna do that now. I'm gonna set the quality down to, like... To, like, um, 420 pixels if I have to. To get this game to not lag. So, yeah, I'm just going to run over here to end it off. So, uh, yeah, next time we will be getting more stuff. Um, what will we be doing next time? Uh, we'll just be advancing on. So, yeah, bye, guys. If I can swipe this down. Um, okay.